Good evening, ladies and gentlemen of the YouTube Pipe community. Lewis coming at you once again. It's been a minute. Isn't that always the case? It is the case. Anyway, um, smoking some luxury bullseye flake in a road town bamboo shanked. I don't know what you want to call this. A brandy, an apple, I don't know. I like it. Got it from Sue Dunhill. From Danny Shore collection. And I've been enjoying it. So, I this video might be long. All my videos are kind of long. Um, let's be honest here. But um, I've got to catch you up on a lot of what's going on. Black tea. Um, and uh, do a little bit of a yabo. Now, I guess it's it's multiple yabos, but it's uh, it's not all of the yabo. So um, went to Florida, took the family to uh, Disney World for Thanksgiving, and uh, got to hang out with my family, and I missed them a lot. And uh, my dad had gone to Texas for a wedding, and. Um, a family member gave him a chest, and in that chest were one, were some of my great uncle's pipes, and that I'm going to say for another video, but uh, you know they're they're nothing extravagant, but they're pretty cool and they mean a lot to me. Uh, I was really hoping to see if we had any of my grandfather's or great grandfather's pipes, but uh, such was not the case. Um, so, things I do have yabos for, um, will we'll come around, we'll come around, I'll, uh, I'll get to that. But first, let's catch up on life. I get out of the army in seven months. That is ridiculous. After spending nine years in active duty, seven months. Um, it's kind of nuts. I don't know exactly, um, well, I know exactly what's going to happen and I know exactly what I'm going to do with my time. Um, but it's been an absolute whirlwind. Um, I'm an ended honest. So the options are partner up with somebody, join a group practice. I could start my own practice or buy an existing practice. Two of those were viable options in where we're going to live. And so I decided, I made the decision, I am going to start my own practice from scratch. I have a good location. There's not a lot of uh, competition in that market. So that's what I'm going to do. And so over the past few months, I've been looking for locations. I've been talking to bankers about getting loans. I've been putting together business proposals. And uh, this past Friday, I signed a 10-year lease for the place where my practice is going to reside. And I put together my LLC. So officially now, I am a business owner. Precision Endodontics LLC. I'm really thrilled. Uh, I hope everything goes super well. Um, I'm praying a lot because I am drinking through a fire hose. In the army and in dental school, they just don't teach you business. Unless you're very lucky. And um, so I'm at this point now where I'm learning about building things and I've got to choose a CPA and I've got to choose an architect and to find a contractor and choose equipment and trying to keep things in a budget and it's crazy. So um, that's one of the biggest things that's going on now. Um, moving on to more fun stuff. Oh, oh, I did have to mention uh, my wife and I found a house. So we're actually gonna be first time homeowners too. Woo! That's a lot of debt. Okay. Anyway, 
I have, uh, let's see, four separate Yabos to do right now. Craziness. Okay, y'all know I love Diebels from Diebels Sportsman's Gallery in Kansas City. Now, um, Diebels used to not be Diebels Sportsman's Gallery. It was Diebels Pipe Maker Tobacconist. And I just so happened to find on Facebook somebody selling this. An original box and what is in it? Oh my goodness. An unsmoked Diebels Calabash with a Perplex stem. Heck yeah. Um, these are generally a little bit bigger than I like, but uh, past few days I've been smoking kind of bigger pipes. It's interesting. Um, feels nice. It's brand new. I don't know when I'm going to get to smoke it, but I'm really going to enjoy it right now. It is on a frame that I've got that is all Diebels pipes. Coincidentally, this weekend I found another Diebels Benchmade pipe on eBay and somebody outbid me in the last five freaking seconds. So that kind of sucks. But anyway, next things next, I made an order on smokingpipes.com because somehow for the first time ever, I got the Esoterica drop. Yes. And so I was able to pick up an eight ounce bag of Pembroke, delicious, delicious stuff, and an eight ounce bag of Penzance, Zen Pants, whatever Derek Pants. And so that's Yabo number two, a pound of tobacco. Sweet. Ah, all right. And so going back, there's been a general dentist that's been helping me kind of set up things for my practice and kind of uh, guiding me a little bit. And just to say thank you the other day, and I knew he enjoyed whiskey, I brought him a bottle of um, Hibiki Japanese Harmony whiskey. Um, extremely, extremely good stuff very difficult to find. It will become impossible to find in the very near future because I think of agricultural issues in Japan and their inability to produce said whiskey. Now that was unexpected for him, but he is totally, totally deserving. And I did not want or expect anything in return. But the gentleman showed up at my in-law's house this past weekend with a box, a Christmas gift. And the man has wowed me once again. Recognize that label. The man went to the evil sportsman gallery And the man bought me a pipe and some tobacco. Huntington is a very nice aromatic. Please excuse the dog in the background. Ta-da! Penny! Shh! Thank you. I gotta show you this thing. It is gorgeous. Look at this beautiful, beautiful Meerschaum. Very intricate design. Let's see if I can get it to focus. Maybe not. Beautiful unsmoked SMS block Meerschaum. And it's a sitter, surprisingly enough. Maybe a little bit of a rocker, but it's a sitter. And so I was blown away by that as well. I'm gonna go take care of this dog and be right back with you. Anyway, I'm back. Guaranteed my dog is going to be annoying. Please forgive me, it is what it is. So, 
one of my very favorite pipe groups, one I am probably most loyal to in general is Briar Nation. They is my homies, and we did a secret Santa this year. A Krampus secret Santa. So, meaning, supposed to send a naughty gift. Well, my poor guy, I, I so my friend Kevin is who I got, and uh, I love him to death, to death, but I was not going to let him get away easy. Um, the dude's in a wheelchair, he can't walk, um, so I got him a gymnastics trophy and a pair of running shoes. <laughs> it's so bad. But I also, he had been fawning over this pipe um, uh, from Briar Works, one that looks a lot like uh, the one Eva Green smokes in Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children or whatever that movie is. I knew he really wanted it and I wanted to get it for him. And so I did. Sent him a few tins of tobacco, a few cigars, a couple other trinkets. Um, just wanted him to know that he was loved. And it seems that um, what goes around comes around because my friend Eric Burkett bombed the shit out of me and just really killed it. Even his mean gift, his Krampus gift, was still outstanding. So, I am going to show you that. Uh, first and biggest item in that box was a full bottle of Weller Special Reserve. I am a bourbon drinker. I enjoy bourbon. I am so going to enjoy that. It's not one that I've actually ever had before, so that's going to be awesome. Then, he put in the box because he's from Columbus, Ohio. These uh, Buckeyes, I had one for dessert tonight. They are very tasty, kind of peanut buttery and milk chocolatey and what's not to love. He threw in a tin of Orlick Golden Sliced, a tin of Dunhill's London Mixture, one of my favorite Englishes, and a tin of uh, Mississippi River. I do love me some Mississippi River. Then he throws in plenty of, uh, of pipe cleaners because we cannot have enough of those. And if he wasn't, if that wasn't enough, dude also throws in a patch. I don't know what I did with this patch. Um, he throws in an Openel number eight carbone. I have an Openel as well. I love Openels. They are an all around fantastic knife and I have wanted a carbon steel blade for a very long time with a sheath, by the way, fantastic. Can't go wrong. And then he shows, sends me eight cigars. These are Diffuser uh, by, I believe these are Alpha Cigar. Yes, the Diffuser. There's two of them, these red labels and these white labels here. I like shorter smokes because I don't have a whole lot of time and uh, also because um, I can't handle all the nicotine. He gave me two of these short, looks like Maduros. I have no idea what they are. I'm sure they're fantastic. And two Punch Edición Limitadas from 2017. So those are going to be freaking awesome. And here was his Krampus gift. Okay, his Krampus gift, I'll read you, says, uh, You have received the Garrett Matthew Bauer pipe. This little gem was handed down to me, and now it's your turn to carry the torch slash pipe. Please enjoy the novelty of this pipe for the next year and then pass it on via the next Briar Nation OGSS if you choose, but not required. Um, the dude is awesome. So his Krampus gift, his mean gift was this. Now, people made fun of this pipe on Briar Nation before. 
I actually really like it. There's some patina on this copper band here that I really friggin' dig. The, the stem is absolutely crazy. The rustication on this thing is insane too, but something about it is just, it is just over the top. This, you're not gonna be able to see, but look at where that draft hole is. It's right on the bottom, so it follows the concept. Penelope, hush. Um, follows the concept of a radiator pipe or any other kind of reverse calabash style system. It's, it's a freaking calabash. It looks like a poker. It is not a poker. It is a calabash, folks. That's freaking fantastic. It only fits one way. I got to figure out how it fits. There we go. And here's that poker. It's freaking fantastic. I love it. All right, that was my four yabos and an update on all the crazy stuff that's going on in my life. Thank you for joining me. I love you all. I appreciate you being so kind with me and uh, understanding of all the damn time that I have not spent on this platform recently. Um, priorities first, family and then starting a business so I can take care of my family. And this growling dog. <laughs> Love you. Blessings and smoke rings. I almost forgot that. It's been too long. Ciao.